All right, for a look at what's happening in the world of entertainment, just talked about Live Nation rescheduling. Here's Marcus Allen appearing as a normal. <laughs> what, are you, what are you drinking today? Just coffee, straight up caffeine and lots of it. I'm just trying to get points because every day at the end of the show, the producers go, they, you always get brownie points for showing them the logo. So I'm just trying to get extra brownie points. There it is, right there. That's all. Uh, hey, I want to tell you about an awesome new movie. There's a guy named Ratman that is remarkable. He's a YouTuber out of London that for the last two years has just been picking up steam crazy. He drops something, it gets 20 million views. Didn't go unnoticed, Jay-Z signed him to a contract and now he has a major motion picture coming out called Blue Story. Uh, the movie is remarkable, much in the same way that last year a foreign film won the Academy Award. I think it might happen again this year and we're catching up with him in his London home. Big up, man. Thank you for having me, man. Huge fan, man. Serious? <laughs> From all, all the way in Sacramento? How did you hear about me? I don't know. Something called YouTube? It's funny, because you never think anybody's um, looking outside of your hometown. So it's always nice to hear that someone knew about me way before, you know, Blue Story and that. So I appreciate that, man. You know, because of your background doing music and content creation, you were pretty much ready to go as a filmmaker with this. Turnkey. Yeah, yeah, I've definitely got an ear for music, maybe because I've been doing music most of my life. Um, so yeah, I've learned a lot of the stages. I literally created my own film score over the years. And um, so by the time I ended up getting to my first film, I was really prepared, man. So yeah, it all worked out pretty well. So tell everybody what they get with Blue Story. What's it about? You get like a, a modern day Romeo and Juliet bromance type of film, two friends who live on opposite area codes and both of the area codes are in a massive gang war. And a scene that you're most proud of? Um, the house party scene. You feel the chemistry and the love and the energy of the house party scene. So oh, yeah. there's a house party scene and I think, you know, you everyone will feel a little bit nostalgic. So yeah, look out for that. <laughs> hey man, it's awesome. Congrats. Thank you, man. I appreciate everything, man. Big up. I can't wait for you guys to uh, see this movie. It's not for everybody. There are some gritty moments, but the love story that he mentions in it definitely is intact. What struck me most unique about this film is how much we have in common with the UK. Uh, the movie deals with a lot of heavy stuff that we're dealing with here in the US that's also going on right there. I recommend it, and it probably will get a nod or two for the Academy Awards. Back to you. Love that you say it's a movie not for everyone. It is gritty at times. Gritty. Yeah, no. <laughs> As it were. All right, Marcus Allen, we do appreciate I'm gritty. It. Yeah, well, not, yeah, I, that's too. All right.